Hi, I'm Kelly from All In Season and today we're going to make one of these cute little mini domes using All In Season products. We can utilise a lot of the um, little bits and pieces that um, might be leftovers from a larger, larger design. So I've got these cute little smaller domes here. This one actually comes from Spotlight. I don't normally like using floral foam. Um, ideally moss would be really good to do use and we've got more of that coming uh, from our suppliers so moss is quite good um, but we are just going to be using the tiniest little piece so as you can see um, what I've done here is just cut a little piece a cube and I've taken a little bit of cold glue but you can use hot glue um, I like cold glue because I work a lot with fresh flowers as well, but just dab a little bit on here, make it blow on it, make it um, a little bit tacky and um, press it on. So this is one that I prepared a little bit earlier and today we're going to be using um, some tea tree, some little nigella pods, um, a little bit of status. Um, we also have some Ming fern, mini fern, some cute little bunny tails, and some ruscus. So these are just the little off cuts, this is a different colour, but this is what the ruscus looks like, and I've just taken some of the, the little um, pieces off the, off the base. Okay. What we need to do is actually cover the base first, just to make sure that we have enough space and I found it easier to work from the bottom up. That's just a little bit of advice for you there. Um, so I've got some little tiny pieces and then I'm just going to make sure with the top that we don't go too high with the, we're going to start with the um, bunny tails. Now when I'm working as well I also like to think of balance so if we start with the more delicate flowers coming through the, the top of the design and then bring it down to the heavier uh, larger focal flowers towards the base. I'm just going to put that in there like that. So that's going to be our highest point but we do need to chop it down just a fraction here and see how they're all coming out of the, the same sort of space like they're growing out of the garden. And we're just going to work our way around with some cute little pieces. And I've got some really nice little straw flowers, helichrysums, and with the cold glue we can actually, because these have very short stems, we can actually just glue a little bit, wait, five seconds or so, and then you can glue that onto, onto there like so, and just, it, it sticks pretty quickly. So we can push some pieces in a little bit closer and some pieces can come out just to create some, some movement. And this status is a really good little filler. But rather than using the whole big piece, you can cut these little pieces off and place those in and this will just add a little bit of filler and another touch of texture and, and colour. Just to give you an idea, I wouldn't put this piece right at the top because it's, it's a larger flower head. Um, I actually might change this one slightly and place that one in there as more of a focal. And I think we are pretty much done. Let me pop the piece on the little dome on top. 